All right, so I've just cut this uh, slab and uh, I'm, I want to make, you know, the edges are real flat or I've just made this uh, cylinder and my edges are a little bit rough. Now I can squeeze them with my fingers a little bit, but what's even better is if I can use a chamois. So you all have um, a chamois that you can get wet, chamois with C-H-A-M-O-I-S, but it sounds like chamois, S-H-A-M-M. I just said it, you know what it sounds like. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fold this over the edge and then I'm gonna squeeze with my fingers. Now, depending how hard I squeeze this edge, I can simply round it a little bit or I can really thin it out. I'm squeezing my fingertips together as I run my fingers down this edge. And that's going to allow me to make a more kind of organic looking edge with this piece. I'm squeezing my fingers together and now this edge is really thin and now I can go ahead and I can, you know, I can add some wiggle and, and curve or I can simply have that edge be nice and, and thin. And so I can, um, it just doesn't look like the cut edge, right? It looks a little nicer. People often do this on the edge of a teacup. They'll pinch the edge of the teacup so that the teacup, it, the edge is thinner for where you put your mouth against it.